Hi Aries and welcome to Intimate Goddess Tarot. My name is Inez <coughs> and this is take two because I was already recording. I put your spread out and uh, and it stopped recording. The camera stopped recording so the spread is already out. I'm not going to reshuffle and redo it. I'm just, I haven't gotten very far on it so I'll let you know what it is but as first let's do the intro. Uh, I'm going to be doing your weekly reading from February 16th to the 22nd. Please keep in mind that these are general love readings, so it cannot and will not resonate with all of you. So, if it doesn't apply, then let it fly. If it does apply, then I would love to read your comments down below. And if you would like to get a personal reading, you can contact me at intimategoddesstarot at gmail.com. Here we go. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. So, this is the cards we have. So, we have the, at the bottom of the deck... We have the Nine of Swords, and we have the Queen of Pentacles and a Tower. We have the Three of Swords and the Seven of Swords. And we have the Star and the Eight of Wands. So some of you guys could have been dealing with a Aquarius, a Scorpio, or a Virgo. And it looks like here there was a tower moment. Someone got hurt here. Some of you guys were hurt. Some of you guys were in a three-party situation. Somebody was sneaking around, cheating, lying, <clears throat> whatever the case may be. And the, whoever this person is, they're going through a healing process right now. And they want to communicate. Somebody here wants to communicate with you guys. So, I'm going to start clarifying because, you know, I like to get straight to the point. Let's see. So, let's start off with the Queen of Pentacles. Let's see why the Queen of Pentacles is here. Okay. Please give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Please give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Please give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Please give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. So, we have the Four of Cups, so somebody here was rejected. We have the Three of Wands here. Somebody's waiting on somebody, and they're feeling rejected. Now, we got the Queen of Swords in reverse, <clears throat> so they're also pissed off. So, whoever this is, is they've been waiting, and they're feeling rejected because it looks like this person is not communicating with you, and all it's doing is pissing you off, and... I'm going to get some more. I'm going to get one more on the Queen of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Please get more information on this Queen of Pentacles. You guys are not speaking. The Four of Swords. You guys are right now, you guys may not be speaking at all. But somebody is waiting on this person to communicate with them. And because this person is making you feel rejected. Or you could have rejected this person. <clears throat> but someone's waiting and they're getting pissed off. They're getting there mad. Please get more information on the tower. Why is the tower here? Please get more information on this tower. Please get more information on the tower. Why is the tower here? Please get more information on the tower. Please get more information on the tower. <clears throat> So we have the Page of Swords, we have the Nine of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands. So the Tower moment looks like what happened here was that somebody communicated to you that they wanted a new beginning. <clears throat> Excuse me. Somebody here wants a new beginning. They want a passionate new beginning. Somebody, either with you or with somebody else. Because somebody's, somebody's here is pissed off. Somebody's mad here because they're feeling rejected with the four cups here. And they're still waiting. But somebody here is communicating. Or somebody communicating that they want to be emotionally happy. This person wants, you want to be emotionally satisfied. And you want stability and you want passion in your life. Look. This is what you want. And somebody's communicating this. 
So this could be somebody, this could be you telling somebody this, or this could be somebody telling you this, because from what it looks like, <clears throat> or, it, or the tower moment could have been being due to the fact that you guys were not communicating. It could be now that this person did communicate with you because this person was making you feel rejected. You was pissed off. You guys were not speaking. And now with the tower moment, this person ended up contacting you, telling you that they want a new beginning with you. They want stability with you. They want to be they want to be happy. They want to be emotionally satisfied. And this person's communicating this to you. So it could be the same person. Because now, because at first we don't have communication, but now we have communication with a king with a page of wands and an ace of wands. That's communication. So this person is communicating this to you now. Or it could be the other version where they actually telling you that they want to you start with somebody else. <laughs> Let's find out about the Three of Swords. Please give more information on the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here? Please give more information on the Three of Swords. Please give more information on the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here? Please give more information on the Three of Swords. Please get more information on the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here? Please get more information on the Three of Swords. Please get more. Please get more information on the Three of Swords. Please get more information on the. There we go. So now we have. <clears throat> we have the Ace of Swords in reverse. This is clarifying the Three of Swords. We have Judgment in reverse. And we have the high priestess. So somebody here was lying to you. Somebody here wasn't being, <coughs> excuse me, they wasn't being honest with you. And you're disappointed. So that's what I'm seeing here in this person's face, in this girl's face. Look at her face. She looks like she's been disappointed. She's been let down. She's been hurt. You know, she thought that you know, that this was something real and it turned out to be nothing but a lie because this person wasn't being honest with her at all. And she's hurt. She's disappointed. She's hurt. I mean, the person lied to her. Things were not fair. This person kept secrets from her. There were secrets that were being kept here that were not being told. I'm going to find out more about that. The Three of Swords. Please get more information on the Three of Swords. Please get more information on the Three of Swords. Please get more information on the Three of Swords. There was an investing in the connection. We got the Seven of Pentacles in reverse here. This person was not uh, investing in the connection. They wasn't being honest with them. They wasn't being loyal. This person was keeping secrets. And... And somebody just ended up getting hurt here. It's like, it seems backwards here. Because we got the tower moment here, but then we have the three of swords here. Yeah, but, but I don't know. <clears throat> we'll see. Where does it go? Because in a way it seems backwards. Let's find out about the Seven of Swords because we got the Three of Swords with the Seven of Swords. So somebody wasn't completely honest either way here. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. Please get more information. See, and the thing about it is that sometimes this thing be coming out backwards. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. And I be picking up on it. Please get more information on the Seven of Swords. <clears throat> Yeah, 
So we have the high priestess here. So there's somebody else. The two of swords. Somebody's not making a decision. We have the knight of pentacles here. Somebody's moving very slow. And we have the wheel of fortune here. So somebody was sneak. Somebody could have been sneaking around with somebody else, wanting a new beginning with someone else. That explains a new beginning. So this could be somebody telling you that they want a new beginning with someone else, because the empress also represents new beginnings. And this person could have been sneaking around with someone else, and they're having a hard. They're trying to make a decision, but between you and someone else, someone that they already have stability with. Because they want a new beginning. They're trying to make a decision between a new beginning, starting new with someone else, or stay with you where there's stability at. Because the Knight of Pentacles, he offers stability. It could be that, or this person's trying to make a decision if they should offer stability to this other person. Please give more information on the Seven of Swords. Please give more information on the Seven of Swords. Please give more information on the Seven of Swords. Please give more information on the Seven of Swords. Aries, you guys are like <clears throat> all over the place. And then we have the uh, Temperance here. So healing needs to take place here. Healing needs to take place. It could be what this person is debating if they should offer stability or not. It could be as simple as that. They're debating if they should offer you stability, if they should actually have this new beginning with you. Yeah, it's backwards. Yeah, this is going backwards because with the tower moment here, this person is communicating that they do want stability and they want a, a solid foundation. They want stability and they want emotional happiness. So, yeah, this is moving backwards. Because you're waiting on communication from this person. Because you guys are not communicating. And finally, the communicant comes in. And that's where they're saying that they want to start with you. And that's, and that's due to the fact that this person was lying. They could have been a three-party uh, three party situation, and they wasn't investing into this connection. They didn't invest in the connection. This person also has secrets, which was the other person that they had on the side. Because this is another woman right here. And the high priestess, she tends to be a mistress as well. So they had somebody else on the side here. Somebody else was on the side. This person has somebody else on the side. That could have been, not everybody has somebody on the side, but this person was keeping secrets from you. And they wasn't not, and they wasn't, they're not sure if they wanted to offer you a new beginning. They didn't know if they wanted a new beginning and stability with you. Because things needed to heal between the both of you guys. Things needed, uh, things needed to be uh, equal give and take. But then now we got the wheel turning. And, and it's turning and turning and turning. Let's find out about the star. Please give more information on the star. Please give more information on the star. Please give more information on the star. Why is the star here? Please give more information on the star. Please give more information on the star. Why is the star here? Please give more information on the star. Please give more information on the star. Please get more information on the star. Please get more information on the star. And by the way, uh, this can go vice versa. So I could easily be picking up on the other on the other person's energy and not yours. So if you need to flip it, by all means, go right ahead and flip it. And this also applies to men, not just to females. Okay, because we all have masculine, feminine energy within us. Okay, so this is what we have. The Two of Pentacles. We have the King of Pentacles and the world. So someone is, see, it's not making any sense because now you're juggling all over again. Now you're juggling about having a new beginning with the King of Pentacles. 
because you see this person as a wish fulfillment. This is a star. So healing and the star also represents self-healing as well and wish fulfillment. So why you, you guys are like all over the place, I swear. Please get more information on the star. 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 Why is the star here? Please get more information on the star. Please get more information on the star. Why is the star here? Please get more information on the star. Please get more information on the star. Something that, that you thought had ended has not ended. So this, you know what? This could be for two different groups of your Aries. That's what it could be. It could be two different groups of you guys that I'm picking up on. That's what it could, that's what I think this is. Two different groups. So look, we got the death card here in reverse. And we have the seven of wands here in reverse as well. So someone here is debating if they should come back. Because there was a, actually they're debating if they should come back and start new again with you. Come back. And stop resisting, stop fighting this, and just come back and start new again with you. So you guys could be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, and a Scorpio. You guys could be dealing with a Capricorn. You guys could be dealing with a Libra. You guys could be dealing with a Pisces. You guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Okay, so we have two. So there's two, there's two groups here. That's what I'm saying. There's two groups here. There's definitely two groups here. So, for one group of you guys, we have, you guys are not communicating. You're pissed off. This person is making you feel rejected. And you're waiting on this person to communicate with you. Finally, this person contacts you, tells you, yes, I do want a new beginning with you. I want to start new. I want stability. I want emotional satisfaction. And... The reason why you guys separated is because this person was not being honest with you. They was not being honest with you. They wasn't investing into the connection. They could have been somebody else on the side or they was just keeping secrets. They could have just been keeping secrets here from you. They could have been keeping these secrets from you here. And then, and now this person wants to come back and start new again. And for other, for a different group of you guys, you guys could have had someone that was actually lying to you. Of course, they're still lying and cheating, being sneaking around, and they're trying to debate. Actually, they wasn't. Well, they could have been cheating. I ain't gonna put it past them. I ain't gonna put it past it. Pass down. So this person could have been cheating, or they could have been lying to you. And now they're trying to debate if they do, if they want a new beginning with you. Because they're not sure if they should start a new beginning with you and have stability with you. They're not sure if they want to. They're not sure if they want it. Because they need to heal. Because the whole entire, uh, this whole entire uh, relationship needs healing because there has been, this relationship has nothing been, it's been nothing but a bunch of lies and deceit. That's all it's been. Bunch of, I mean, for both groups, there've been nothing but lies and bunch of deceit. That's it. Period. One group is different. The other group is different. One group, they're made up their mind that they do want a new beginning. The other group, they still juggling the idea. They are still trying to make this head over heart decision if they should actually come back, you know, and start this new beginning with you and have stability. And there's gonna be communication. So this is like it's repeating the same shit all over again. Let's find out about the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Please get more information on the Eight of Wands. Okay, with well, the Eight of Wands, we have the Five of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody that's somebody somebody wants to come out from the cold, and they want to offer you an apology here. With the Page of Pentacles, this person wants to offer you an apology for 
walking away because we have the eight of pen the eight of cups here so this person wants to offer an apology either due to the fact the reason why you walked the reason why you walked away because it whoever this person is they're offering an apology to the person that had walked away from them let's say that this, that makes more sense please get more information on the eight of wands please get more information on the eight of wands please get more information on the eight of wands Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. They're not trying to fight with you. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. Please give more information on the Eight of Wands. So they're going to come clean. And they're no longer in a three-party situation. Okay, for some of you guys, this was a three-party situation. It was. So we have the five of wands in reverse. So whoever this person is, they're going to be contacting you because they want to come out. Because they're going to be apologizing to you. Whoever walked away, the other person will be contacting the person that walked away. They're going to be contacting you to apologize. And they don't want to have no conflict with you. Because we have the five of wands and the strength card in reverse. They're not gonna they don't want to be fighting with you. They're not gonna be holding themselves back. Um we have the three of swords in reverse here. So this person is no longer in a three-party situation. This person now wants we have the seven of swords here in reverse. So now this person wants to come clean and they want to tell you the truth. And we have the Ten of Cups here because now they want commitment. And they know that for in order for them to get the Ten of Cups with you, they're going to have to come clean and speak the truth. They know it. So, it's kind of like the same story being told over and over. Except one of you guys, actually no. It's the same thing. It's the same. It's told, it's told me the same story all in one spread. The same damn story. They're coming back because they want a new beginning. It's right there and right here. Same story. It was telling me the same thing over and over. So, I mean, for it could have been two different groups. It could be for one group, you guys did have a three-party situation. And now you want to come back. And now they want to come back and apologize, come clean, and tell you the truth. And they're no longer in this three-party situation. The other part of another group of you guys, it wasn't a three-party situation. It was just... This person disappointed you. This person disappointed you. They kept secret from you. They wasn't living up to your standards. You know. And you was pissed off. And you guys wasn't communicating for a while. And now communication is starting to come in. That's your tower moment. So. It basically told me the same story. It wasn't telling me anything really different. Because they kept repeating the same thing over and over. So, Aries. Let's get a guidance message for Aries. Please give me 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 a guidance message for Aries. Team spirit, work together as a team. Cooperation, enthusiasm, loyalty, and kindness will ensure a successful outcome. Okay, Aries, this is all I have for you guys. I will see you guys again for your weeklies. Take care, be safe, and don't forget to sh uh, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and uh, stay cool, Aries.